presents a presentation of Anime Championship Wrestling, a standard of CAW. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to the 2019 ACW Tournament Cruiserweight Clash. And folks, we have finally arrived to the final match of the first round. We will finally find out our fourth match of the second round. As Soma Yukihara, the young chef, will go one-on-one -on -one against Asano Gakushu. We're going to find out right now who's completing the second round. First round match of the Elite Tournament. I am Hakeem Johnson, your ACW commentator, as always. And we get set for this upcoming matchup between Somi Yukihara and Asano Gakushu. Somi Yukihara having a wonderful night, although he was not able to win the X Silver Destiny match. He had a stellar performance in that matchup. And he was drafted to Impulse at the ACW draft a couple of weeks ago. So we will see how Somi will fare against other people within the Impulse brand. Let's take a look at the statistics here from the anime Food War Shogo Kukeki. No Soma. The signature maneuver the Eat Defeat as he appeared in his first ever Excel Road Destiny match at Animania 5. So a lot of riding for the young chef. You can feel the condensation through this entrance. We're looking at a man that was a student in class 3A at his junior high school, one of the big five in that school. The man's a student council president. He's the son of the board chairman over there, the top student of the school. This man has been pampered to be successful and one of the best in the world. However, will that all matter when Asano Gakushu steps into the ring ACW for the first time ever against a young talent like Soma Yukihara. Asama has a very high opinion of himself. That clearly is not denied here. Let's take a look at this man's credentials here from the anime assassination classroom. The signature read with a virtuoso. And this is his first elite tournament appearance here in Sacramento tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, we get set for the final first round match of the Cruiserweight Clash. Both men get ready here as the bell rings. The winner of this match will meet Davis in the second round of the Elite Tournament. Looks like both men are jaw jacking between one another. Two different personalities for sure. As the collar and tie lockup begins here, Asano able to win that round with a side headlock. So not to be deterred here, pushes Asano off. Ducks under, Asano comes back, leap frog. Asano comes back once again. And Asano with a nice counter with that wrist lock. A very unique counter there by Asano, but Soma answers back with an arm bar. Never gets old, Asoma. Showing that he can be just as cocky as Asano. And you notice that between these two, that they're different, but they're similar in terms of their cockiness. But the energy is different when they're cocky. And I'm starting to pick up in this match. Soma whips Asano to the corner here. Big elbow right across the face. And Asano rolls out to catch some second breath. And Soma wants the challenge. Asano's going to make Soma wait. Make him play his game. Soma. I'm going to get his hands on Asano. Asano mentally playing mind games. Soma to make a mistake that he can uh, capitalize on. Look at this, just jaw jack with Soma. Wow! What a forearm. And what another one. Tyra shook up Asano. Gonna counter it. Soma backflips over him. Nice spinning wheel kick onto Asano. Soma covered in the middle of the ring here. One. And kick out one. And look at this. A nice hurricanrana by Soma, and Asano looks to be in trouble here. 
Big knife edge chop. Soma looking to the top. Torino DDT. Point blank period in the middle of the ring. Cover. One. Two. And Asano finds a way to kick out. Doesn't let all that credential that is junior high school is helping Asano one bit. This isn't junior high. This is the elite tournament. Asano gets kicked down by the young chef. Asano slow to his feet. Well, this is Asano trying to dump Soma there, but no dice. Soma kicks it across. And Asano's face on the top rope. Nice for Karana. Nice precision from that Arana by Soma. Another pin attempt by Soma here. One, two, and Asano with the rope break. No one is surrounding. He's able to grab the ropes for a break. As we take a look at the high flying offense of Soma here from the top rope, Herba Karana nailed it perfectly onto Asano, almost dropping him on his head. Shows the tension as we're back live here. Soma now going to go after that right arm of Asano. Oh! That arm is not supposed to bend that way. Trust me, I'm not a doctor, nor do I play one on TV. But even I know that arm is not supposed to bend that way. Someone now continue to work over Asano. Looks like all that intellect is really not helping Asano. His dad can't save him from this one. With Asano now thinking quickly there with that nice leg snap. Hyper extending the knee of Soma. Goes for the cover up, that double drop. There's one. Soma able to kick out before two. Oh! And a big boot right across the face of Soma. And the utter disrespect by Asano continues to baffle me. Knowing that he hasn't had the best run so far. Oh, man! What a move there by Asano. Dropping him face first and almost got a three off it. Soma able to escape. And Asano, just like that, has taken control of this matchup. For a camel clutch, but Soma's foot was too close to the ropes here. Now, Asano jaw jack to the referee. Is this how entitled and pampered this dude is? Focus on your opponent. Stop jaw jacking to the referee. He's doing his job. Asano now slow to get Soma into a certain position here. Oh, went for a left there, but Soma ducked. But Asano then into the midsection. Now Soma up, nice snap to suplex, sends Soma right back down to the mat. Asano now climbing to the top here. It's going to go from here. Big elbow drop right across the chest of Soma. There's one, there's two, and no, only a two. Look at the replays from Asano here. This devastating maneuver looked like an inverted DDT or some form of DDT, but nonetheless, that did not put away Soma. So they will go to the top for a nice elbow drop right across Soma's chest, but Soma would still kick out before three. One thing I'm noticing about Asano here is that the man likes to wrestle in a more methodical way. Even though he can pull out maneuvers like an elbow drop from the top, he can fly like a like a cruiserweight if he wanted to, but he would like to slow down the pace and work over someone like Soma, especially with that uppercut just now. It's a worthy, it's a worthy tactic for someone like Asano to where Soma's going to have to fight back now. Now Asano here with the side chin lock. Now Soma down, Soma trying to be careful not to have his chin pinned on the mat here. This is what Asano's trying to do here. Asano's looking for an out or some escape. This compromising position. I guess we can't let the uh, pedigree of Asano fool us. He's more than game to wrestle someone like Soma. And Soma able to escape. Get to the midsection. And so Soma! Inverted Frankensteiner from out of nowhere! That was a desperation move, but it worked! The cover! There's two and no Asano! Gets his shoulder up barely before three. Soma knew that he was starting to lose control of this match. Pulled out an inverted Frankensteiner out of nowhere, out of desperation. But that's what he had to do. As now it's to the corner here. Another elbow right across the face. In the face! In the face! 
Asoma. Oh, went for it again. Asoma that time moved out the way. Oh, wait a minute. Has to, uh, wait, Soma's shoulders are pinned down. Soma lucky with the rope still by the grab for a break. And look at that perfect head scissors takedown. A little bit of finesse there, too. Just like this. Leg drop. Very precise by Asano. Going for the pin attempt. There's two. And Soma with the shoulder up. Asano's moveset has been very refined. Clear, very uh, crisp. It's working for him. Now Soma tosses the outside back first. I think Asano wants to go flying here. And, oh, wait a minute! High elevated baseball slide by Asano. And that's just working smart, in my opinion. Let's take a look at this actions again. Perfect head scissors onto Soma. Follows it up with a leg drop right onto that very same nick he just head scissor. Tosses Soma back first, and you would think he would go for a high risk maneuver, but he knew his position, he knows his strengths. He went for a baseball slide. It was just as effective as doing a plancha or a topecon heel or a suicide dive. And that's the one thing I like about someone like Asano using his strengths to his advantage. He may not have the velocity of a Soma or a Deku or an Akira or a Ryoma, but damn is the man smart, he can be able to put away people this way as we're down to eight here. Asano's looking for a count out victory. And Soma barely gets there before 10. But look at this. Boom! What an uppercut! Asano just right there to take advantage of Soma. He probably knew that Soma was going to make the count and still knocked him down when he needed to. Oh, and what a left! The, the, the arrogance of Soma. So, of course, the arrogance of Asano is one thing. It's a bit of an off-putting attitude, but this work in the ring that Asano is doing is very impressive. Work that a lot of wrestlers in the Cruiser division, as much as I love their style, don't take heat to a line. You want to work smart these days, not hard. As Asano kicks to the back, drops him with an elbow. Asano could very well get away with this here. If Soma doesn't do anything right now. Soma does answer back with a punch. Big forearm. Big elbow. Bro drops him with a bulldog. Soma has to be exhausted. Look at this. He can barely get his whole strength on top of the turnbuckle. But he's got to act now. Drop kicks him. Look at that Soma. The fatigue is starting to wear in. Asano's offense has been very effective on Soma in these past couple of minutes. Can this be the time that Soma takes advantage of the situation? Has the arm here. And it's going for a key lock onto Asano. But Asano punching his way out of it. Arrested by Asano to the corner here. Sends Soma to the middle here. Asano bouncing on the ropes from the corner. Sunset flip onto Soma. Shoulders are down. Asano looking for the victory. There's two. No. Oh, that was close. That was way too close for Soma to lose. I know a lot of people have their doubts against Asano here tonight, but I think Asano's really proven people, especially someone like me, wrong here. Oh, and Asano got his leg caught. Soma. With a spring for her Corona out of nowhere. What a comeback for sure. Take a look at this again. Drop kick by Soma. And then Asano caught his leg onto the corner with that springboard for Corona afterwards by Soma. Looking to find capitalization into his offense. And now we are back to square one with Soma. Oh my god, what a form. Asano just continues to cut. Soma's momentum every chance he can get. Scoop slam, no. Soma closes Asano from the behind. Up, oh, roll up with the schoolboy. Shoulders are down. One, two. Asano trying to reach the ropes and he cannot. He does escape, however, before three. A punch by Asano. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. He's got a lot. He's going to go for a year. Virtual Soul. And somebody. Oh, and Soma was lucky. Soma brought the ropes too close to him to get a break. Asano, very upset. 
He thought he had that in the bag. And quite frankly, if that rope break didn't come, the Sun might have very well won this match. The match continues in Sano. Big knee there sends someone down in a seated position. Sano here. Oh, what a slap! Right across the face. How disrespectful. As much as I'm appreciating his work in the ring here tonight, that attitude is just off-putting. So as I let that deter him, Solo continues to strike Asano down here. Oh, the he defeat here! Oh, Asano with the right form! Asano gonna take advantage, Russian leg sweep, and gets himself back on his feet. Asano continues to impress throughout this match. I think someone even has submitted, even if he won't admit it in public. So from the top here. Oh! Spinning wheel kick, both men are down. That took a lot of Asano. But he crawls over for a cover. This could very well be in here. Oh, and so much barely, just barely gets his shoulder up. Let's take a look at this again. Asano able to nail the Virtuoso onto Soma. But luckily for Soma, he was near the ropes to call for a break. And then he would set up the Russian leg sweep here to counter Soma's maneuvering into the spinning wheel kick. And Asano would wipe himself out as long, along with Soma, excuse me. We are back live and this match continues. This might actually be my favorite match of the first round. My personal opinion. You may disagree, that's fine. Sano from the apron here. Sunset flip. Shoulder down. Soma looking for an escape. There's two. And Soma able to kick out. Chop blocks there by Soma. Cuts in this section onto Asano. Oh, and a super kick onto the back. And I think the chef is ready to go into second gear. So we'll go to the corner here. Knee sends down Asano to the mat. So now from the top. Oh, the same top back first. Right on top of Asano. Asano's slow to get up here. I don't think he knows where he's at. Soma's measuring up here. Kick, no, Asano missed it. Oh, kick to the back. That kick to the back, Asano did not see coming. And now Soma may be measuring up for what I believe is going to be the eight defeat that he was looking for throughout the match. Soma with the cover. One, two. Soma defeats Asano. What an outstanding match to close out the first round. The sent on by Soma, followed by kicking him, only to come back with a kick to the back of Asano's head, which would then set up his devastating eat defeat. And Soma is going to the second round of the 2019 Elite Tournament. What a contest between two athletes. That was a hard fought victory that Soma had. And now Soma will meet Davis, and now we have our second round complete. And let's run it down. So Yuki Hara will face Davis in the second round of this tournament. And then you also have the winner of that match going to take on the winner of Akira Kurusu and Izuki Midori Deku in the second round as well. The leader of the other side, Kazuki Muto, goes one-on-one -on -one against Ma. The winner of that match will take on the winner between Ryoma Edison and Gone. This is looking like to be an all-time elite tournament going by that second round. It is anyone's tournament to win. Will it be the young chef? Will it be the likes of Akira or Deku or Ryoma Davis? Will it be Mob? Will it be any one of these contestants? We will find out. I will see you in the second round of the Elite Tournament. Until then, stay cool. Stay cool.